Can I help you? Oh, uh, yeah, I was just looking for, uh, oh, this lint. Um, I dropped it and it got blown over here. Uh, a lint collection. You have a lint collection? Well, y yeah, it's, um, it's a new mar investment market. You know, I, I read it in this thing. So that's great. Here, let me get you a baggie. Uh, Good hunting. Because I didn't tell you. Oh, also, you're out of vagus, so. So, darling, how are you? I'm fine. Your mother tells me that you're having a little financial trouble and that I should help you streamline your spending. That's thoughtful. Oh, what's this? Starting a lint collection. <laughs> well, at least you're doing something right. Did you read that article on lint collecting in Bloomberg's Business Week? I just love Business Week. So, sweetheart, did you just go through a breakup? No. Well, she spent an awful lot on toaster doodles. Grandma, I would never binge eat on sweets to cope with my feelings of inadequacy and loneliness. Six hundred dollars. <sighs> They're Connor's favorite. Connor? My boyfriend. Grandma, don't you remember? I brought him to your birthday. Oh, well, I was very drunk. <laughs> So, are you in this, uh, what's his face? Are you, um... Uh... Oh, I, he wanted to take a break, so we're taking a break, and... Uh, but we're gonna get back together, you know, if he ever calls me again. I'm gonna have a toaster doodle. Do you, do you want a toaster doodle? No, thank you, dear. Bars, bar, 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 you spend a lot in bars. Oh, those are dates with Connor. Who's Connor? Yeah, call me old-fashioned. Old-fashioned. But a man should pay for a date. Well, but then you have to kiss them or, you know, and... I just hate having to figure out the exchange rate, you know? Like, does KFC count as food because it's food or... But if you go to an Italian restaurant and it's so much nicer, you get drinks or you go to a movie, it's just like, what do I owe these guys? A dinner in a three-star restaurant with one drink is one and a half hand jobs. Oh my god, really? No! <laughs> First of all, you don't owe them anything. Second, no man wants a hand job, let alone half a hand job. He should pay just for the pleasure of your company. Where does the line between dating and prostitution start? When you sleep with them for money. Now, burger joint, curry curry, seek gike. I mean, all this eating out adds up. God, I never ate me out. Took me out to, to restaurants. I, I said eat, but I meant took. I, I've never had sex. Mm-hmm. Movies. Did he ever pay for anything? Yes. Um, no. I, well, one time he let me put my laundry in with his. Planned Parenthood. Three times. I had a really stubborn... Uh, oh, yeah, it's all right. It's all right. I understand. Sometimes they can be very persistent. A yeast infection, Grandma. Right. Look. If you keep wasting 1500 a month on this deadbeat, you're never going to be able to come with us for Christmas to Harry Potter's world. Is my heart is my keep Then you are threatening me Is my heart is my keep Then you are threatening me <laughs>